let's go find another piece. Lanji found a piece of fish and went back to her hide under this piece of wood to chew it up and partake of it. Okay, now I need oxygen. for another piece or what? She loves her food. This is a West African lungfish brought up terrace and that a nectans. Still a baby, we got her from an eBay vendor about half a year ago. At eight inches. There she looks like about a foot. They're adorably slow and primitive fish, or should we say animals. Come on, sweetie, it's just a piece of poop. That's right, spit it out. Go get something real to eat. How about that herring head on the on the colander? Are you feeling it? No, I ain't feeling it. No, go, go farther, hunt. Pellets too. Just, yep, suck it in. There you go. Inside the mouth, there is like a vice. V I S E. It's a tool for crushing crustaceans. A sharp vice. And their lungfish are some of the best masticators, which means they chew everything real thoroughly until their food is mashed and pureed and completely covered and mixed with the saliva. And the saliva is really thick, it looks like a mucus. They shoot it in and out of the mouth. Some portions come out of the gills, out of the mouth when they eat. They look funny when they chew. You see the rudimentary gill structures on outside. A small portion of the gills looks uh, grows outside, but they're obligate air breathers. They need to breathe air to survive. Gills do not su supply enough oxygen for them. deny access to air, this fish will drown. 
it's an oxymoron of sorts They're so slow and primitive and clueless, it's, it's cute. Keep looking, you find, you'll find something. There you go. Little bits of pellets, little bits of herring. We've kept some of aquatic frogs, like African clawed frogs. Their face is identical when they grab something and, and chew it or eat it and swallow it. Except they don't masticate, they just arrange it well and push it down the throat. This is one of the four species of lungfish that live in Africa. Africa is the only continent that has multiple species. Altogether, there's only six species in, the, in existence. One in South America, one in Australia, and four in Africa. Most of them are, except for the, some part of, part of Africa, they're in the southern hemisphere. You can see it's got very strong muscles. They stretch from the snout all the way to the base of the of the head. When she flexes them, you can see that. So they're able to crush toughest crustaceans, mollusks in the wild. Second in scales, pellets, crumbs. <laughs> she spit out that little piece. I don't know why I say she, I think it's a she, I, but I have no idea. Crumbs, crumbs. Can't neglect them. Some scales for roughage. Didn't like that white piece, whatever it is. Probably excrement. Yeah, they're so clumsy and so slow. I think it appeals to some people because some people keep longfish alone for tens and tens of years and enjoy them.
it's funny how they use the lobed lobe fins R reminiscent of how reptiles and amphibians use their four, four feet or four legs like looking at a slice of time, frozen in time, 400 million years ago, nothing's changed. Its ancestors were doing the same. Such a long time ago, it's un unimaginable. Half a billion years ago. Crumbs, sweet crumbs. We had the same species at 40 inches when we lost her. I really miss it, miss her, that fish. It was a hoot. An acquired taste. such a quirky fish that is also that is actually more closely related to amphibians and reptiles I think than if I'm if memory serves it is closer related to them than, than to fish Okay, all set. We can go hide and digest for the rest 23 hours and 45 minutes until the next time. Doing it air. It's been a long time, like 10 minutes since you gulped. That's right, we need some air. Up, 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 up. Ah, nice down they're so clumsy all right that's our little West African lungfish product terrace anectans